that I love, okay? I'm drinking coffee to tonight. No Hennessy, no wine, okay? It's from a company that I love, and you know I only repeat human hair companies if I love their hair, and this company is by Lace Wigs, and I have gotten some winners, winners, winners with this company, okay? To be honest with you, I don't remember what they sent, like always with this human hair stuff, okay? Because y'all know I'm a synthetic type of girl. So let's look at this wig and see what they sent, okay? Um, they sent stocking caps like always. Um, they sent a, a, a card on how to take care of the wig. And then the wig itself, okay? I'm reading off the label. It says the 13 by six lace front bob wig is 12 inches long and it's in the style deep curly. But look in, look in the description box, girl. I'm gonna put all that stuff in there for you to see. So let's take deep curly out the, the pack, okay? It has paper on the inside. Let's look at the cap construction, okay? There's that 13 by six parting space that you get. You get a comb here, a comb here, and look at all that parting space. And by lace wigs goes ahead and tints that lace for you. So if you're a beginner like me, you ain't gotta worry about messing the wig up. In the back, there's a comb, a strip of lace, and this is one of the main reasons why I like Ballet's wigs, because their wigs feel so flush to my scalp, because they include these little adjustable straps that are like bra hooks, okay? Just like my bra keep me secure, Ballet's wigs keep my wigs secure on my head, okay? Y'all, look at that curl pattern. Now, I have reviewed wigs like this before, a short little curly bob. But I have a feeling that this one is going to be constructed better than the other one that I had because it comes with that tinted lace, that little bra strap that's going to make it flush on my little bald head, okay? Let me put it on and see what it do, y'all, before I cut the lace off. See, that's what I mean about that little strap. That little bra clasp thing, y'all, it makes all the difference in the world. Look at that. Okay, and because it comes with all that parting space, look, I can part it over there. I can part it over here. I can part it down the middle if I want. I can do whatever I want in this wig because it's so versatile. Okay, let me cut this lace off. Play around with it. And y'all know by play around with it, all I mean is I'm going to run my fingers through it. And then I come back with my final thoughts. <laughs> see i didn't even put no powder on that and that looks like it is coming out of my scalp that looks really good so if you are beginner friendly like me i cannot say it enough you need to go check out by lace wigs because y'all this was literally me cutting the wig out of the pack and then just running my fingers through it and you get this cute big hair don't care math natural messy look and this is super cute i think that this um is some because somebody asked me that can i do age appropriate wigs and i think that this would be cute for any age if you ask me i love this look 
I think that it is very cute. It's very well constructed. I wasn't getting any shangling, shedding or tangling before I cut the lace. And I'm not, uh, now after I've cut the lace, I cannot stress to you how much I love bi lace wigs, specifically if you're beginner friendly and you don't believe in bleaching knots and tinting lace and all that other jazz, because I'm a lazy girl. I like to take some out the pack, put it on and go. And this wig affords you that with a bomb look. I still hadn't put any powder in that part, but of course you can when you get ready to wear it out. This wig is A1. I'm thinking that I'm gonna wear this to work tomorrow. I love this entire look, okay? I definitely recommend Bi Lace wigs. They're so nice to me. They always give me a discount code. So like I said, if you look in that description box, I'm pretty sure it is there. Y'all, this is winner, winner, chicken dinner. This one is cute. Like David Boy would do, okay? I definitely recommend this one. Like I always say, maybe you're not into wigs. Maybe it's your Auntie Deborah. Maybe, maybe it's your Uncle David, okay? And I got Uncle David. Maybe he wanna get into these wigs. You let him get this one, honey, cause look. Mm. Until next time, which will be extremely soon. Let me let y'all look at that again. Bye, guys. <laughs>